Uh oh. Time to do some bad stuff with Falcon, I hope. Alright, will we go after Catwoman? It's me. <laughs> I think if this were all mine, I would probably put in some really nice classical music. Maybe Rachmaninoff. Episode 1. Nice, very nice. Realm of Shadows. Oh god, I'm still keeping the tickets. She was really after him. Allegations that Dent may have actually been involved in the break in. Hmm. Talk about dirty politics. Does Hills interesting really think these accusations hold any water with the voters? Or will it be perceived as a desperate attempt from a flailing campaign to take down one of Gotham's most promising young politicians? Suddenly, even the youngest, most promising politicians. Nice. Even the most promising politicians, I was about to say, have to make compromises with filthy criminals. Oh, that's nice. Let's see. That's probably Martha Wayne? No, 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 no. That's Vicky. Vicky Vale. Investigative journalist. Gotham Gazette. She's a really nice character. And I do believe Bruce and her have some history. Oop, ta ta ta. Bad. Bad, Philip. Press the wrong button. Carmine Falcone. The worst kind of gangster. One who tries to mingle with high society. He seems to have his hands in everything. Including smuggling, real estate, bribery and fraud. I could haul him to jail, but he'd walk the next day. I could shut down one operation, but two would pop up in its place. His empire is vast and multi-layered. Finding hard, admissible evidence is required for a conviction. That's it! I do believe that Falcone has been taken down by the bat a number of times. Uh-oh. Fifteen! Jeez. When Enterprises circa 1870. Alright. Who's that? That's Penguin? That's how he looks in the game. Really? He was a childhood friend, but he's almost a stranger to me now. Just like me, his family fell apart here in Gotham. He went off to boarding school in England, and there our paths diverged. He seems to have fallen into a life of crime. The last two decades gave him a lengthy rap sheet and a strange nickname, the Penguin. What happened to you, Oz? Cat burglar. <laughs> Hamilton Hill, so that's the current mayor, the one we are butting heads against. Harvey Dent. New friend and the best district attorney Gotham City has seen in years. His political ambitions have always been as big as his ego, and now he's hoping to become mayor. He's got so many great f ideas for how to save the city. I think he'll be good for Gotham, but I have to steer him down the right path to get there. He's easily swayed by anyone with power, regardless of their murky morality. Alfred Pennyworth, faithful, patient, ever helpful Alfred. He's been a part of my family, my whole life, father, figure, and amazing friend. Yeah. Anyone else? Thomas and Martin Wayne, deceased. Yep. I think we're done. Oh, of course. 
James Gordon. Let's see what our relationship with him is right now. Good by the book cop in the department that doesn't trust Batman. He was recently trapped to lead a major crime task force. Tapped, not trapped. An impressive promotion, so he's doing something right. I think he could be a trustworthy and reliable source of info, but I'll need to cultivate, cultivate that relationship. He's a family man, so he's not willing to... whoops. To take necessary risks on the street. That's fine, I'll take the risks. Good. Let's see. Data port. The back computer should be able to read whatever data is on that store drive. Alright, let's get the data then. Anything else? Ooh, gadgets table. Bear grapple. Can't believe I let her take that. <laughs> That's six. She sold from the bat. Knock out electricity in the area. And I suppose that cat woman would have preferred the latter. Ah, uh, cat woman. <laughs> Funny. The newest addition can program it to reveal trace elements in a confined space. Excellent. I've got an. Excellent selection. Oh, bat rhymes never bad to look like at those. The edge. Could be sharper. <laughs> exactly what I was thinking, Brucey boy. Oh, smoke pellets. We already well, used one of those. The mayor's office was a success. Good. Nearly fell off a building for this. Let's not pretend this is the first time something like that has happened. Shall we, Bruce? Movie tickets. Yeah. Movie? It's, it depends on the medium, I suppose. Sometimes it's movie, sometimes it's me uh, opera. Voice modulation. Wayne Enterprises really outdid themselves with this version. Didn't that raise some questions? Got some feed access. Da then pressures mayor to decry vigilantes. Oh, he's against the vigilantes. Gotham District Attorney Harvey then calls upon the mayor's office to take public stand against the wave of vigilante actions sweeping the streets. From the uptake in citizen less shootings to the costumed superhero. Superhero? Batman! Dent is currently enjoying a surge in popularity with one of the lowest criminal backlog indexes in the state. His groundbreaking victims assistance program was part of the platform that drove his most recent successful bid for re election since becoming Gotham's youngest district attorney at age 26. Oh, nice. Police Lieutenant Daftali Task Force. So he's a far cry from being basically commissioner of the entire police force, isn't he? Oh, wait. Ah, yes. Gotham City Police Commissioner Peter Grogan appointed Lieutenant James Gordon to lead a major task force after criminal chatter in the Gotham underworld recently increased to an alarming degree. In a press conference earlier today, Lieutenant Gordon insisted that we are aware of the various elements appearing and mobilizing en masse in our city. At present, they are unknown, but not noticed. We will find them. Gordon earned an honorable discharge from the USMC before joining the GCPD and has quickly risen through the ranks. He has frequently stated that the Marine Corps made him the man he is today. And Wayne Enterprises funds Arkham Asylum replacement. The charitable arm of Wayne Enterprises, headed by Robert and Regina Zellerbach, which we have met, has announced funding for a new mental health care facility to replace the outdated Arkham Asylum for years. The asylum has made headlines for its inhumane approach to patient treatment and its violent, oftentimes deadly, prisoner escapes. But soon that will no longer be the case. The Timerson Martha Memorial Hospital, as it will be called, will offer a mixture of maximum security confinement with modern mental health care practices to truly heal those who are suffering. Ambitious plans are already underway to transfer current Arkham inmates as soon as construction completes and implement the critical program of rehabilitation and release. 
That's a great, really a, a much needed replacement. A memorial hospital, fantastic. And it does justice to my parents' memory. Nope. Data port. Let's see. Oh, I even have a special chair. That's lovely. Just lovely. Let's find out what was so important. Yes, let's do. Encrypted. Hmm. Wait, no surprise there. Seven bedrooms, two kitchens, a library, a gymnasium, a basketball court, and a movie theatre. And yet I always find you here. In a dark, damp cave. In front of a computer. <laughs> I'm more at home here than the rest. The similarities between me and Bruce Wayne are surprising. Sure, I can see the headlines now. Bruce Wayne, billionaire, entrepreneur, cave dweller. <laughs> Quite an eclectic resume. Did you find out what that um, cat woman tried to say? <laughs> In the process. This is sticking so hard. What are we looking at? Let me try a different angle. Yes, I'm a man of angles, apparently. Oh, now that's interesting. Detective job. This is a map of the East Side shoreline, but it could mean any number of things. Money, weapons, drugs, everything flows through that port. Maybe it's where Mayor Hill picks up his dry cleaning. Oh, of course it is. Can't make sense of it yet. There's still plenty of files to decrypt. And in the meantime... Oh, you know. I saved you what I could. Thanks, so. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, the same couldn't be said for the bar. I had to literally pry Mrs. Zeller back away. But you'll be to hear everyone has left. Including Mr. Falcone. Scum. I would have been tempted to be far less polite. I'd recommend leaving the fist fights to your alter ego. Bloodstains are much harder to remove from a tuxedo. It was a keep your enemies closer situation. Hopefully not <laughs> close enough to stab you in the back. Never that's For the close. record, your father despised men like Falcone. Thought they ruined Gotham's stellar reputation. Back when it still had one? It can again, Bruce. And it will. Though people like this cat woman aren't helping. Is she new to town? I've never seen her before. Hopefully she's just a tourist. That is doubtful. Oh, I already checked the codex. Not much to find, apparently. A few burglaries, break-ins. Seems to lay pretty low. You could learn a thing. Interesting. Or two from her. You can't step outside without it ending up in the news lately. As Bruce or Batman. I stay out of sight when I need to. Define need to. Well, you know, Whenever Harvey when falls, I need to grab people. It's exhausting. <laughs> uh, after the press conference tomorrow, I'll mark your calendar as exhausted then. The media isn't good for anyone's health. I don't mean to beat a dead argument, but... No one's going to figure it out now. Trust me. Miss Vale noticed your injuries, so did Mr. Dent. If they put it together with the incident at the mayor's office, it would undo all the long nights and close calls we've endured to get here. You're in the spotlight more than ever. You have to be careful. You're right, you're right. I should have cancelled the event. But I know how much pressure you're under. I don't mean to add to it. It's okay. You don't. I know you're only looking out. You never could you add to pressure, Alfred. Great places some night, though I'm partial to heights. <laughs> uh, That's kind of an amusing idea. And our curse. Old man bats. One more worry for the list. Park 6 a.m. I thought I saw Oz. It's been, what, 20 years? Last time I saw him. We were in grade school. Indeed. You two were thick as thieves. Oswald, however... I guess that he's the little squirt on the right. 
Dishonor, Aww. discharge, illegal boxing matches, arms dealing, prison stents? They Grand Slam, if I'm using the expression correctly. I wouldn't know, are. but you probably Oswald are. He claimed he only <laughs> wanted to catch up, but his behavior following his family's collapse is troubling. Why he's returning now, I haven't the faintest idea. It's probably not a coincidence, but I'll give him a chance. But it's not a coincidence. You think he might but I'll give him a chance. <laughs> this Catwoman shows up around the same time Oswald comes back to town. Might not be a coincidence. Oswald's hey, that's crimes, that's actually a bit far-fetched. Are on a much smaller scale than robbing City Hall. Well, he was always trouble growing up, but <laughs> it's the fun kind of trouble. You both were not anymore. Even though you and Young Master Cobblepot used to be close, I'd advise you to be cautious. I agree. But I know you can't abandon a good mystery until it's solved. I'll World's be best detective, Alfred. When you see what's become of his park, I think you will. The one that got away. Nice. I'm absolutely pleased with... With the Bruce Wayne portion of this game so far. It's super interesting and... Does highlight him as the curious detective type. Oh. Where are you? Oh, nice. Don't suppose I can talk with you, mate. No, I wanted to click at the newspaper. Damn it. Go back. I was just going towards it, and now, don't tell me it's gone. Ah, good. Wayne shuns Falcone, a dent fundraiser. <laughs> this is gonna score me points. Not with Falcone, or his businesses. But hey, oh, damn it, I saw another point and now I'm up again. Uh, I'm so bad at this. So bad. <laughs> I just want to see all of Bruce, Bruce's reactions. All right, that wasn't much of a reaction. Nothing here. Okay, we can finally move on. Homeless person. All right. Thank you, sir. No need to thank me. Bruce Wayne, helper of the city's pariahs. I'm pretty sure that if he opens up his wallet, money is gonna flow out of it endlessly. <sighs> Great. <laughs> the statue but no eyes well I did just get his message so no surprise there shopping cart smoking man let's kill a few minutes by talking to the hey. Mohawk, dude. Alright. Thank you for... the enlightening conversation. <laughs> hmm. Interesting. No graffiti here. Let's see what the plaque has to say. Well, it isn't what it used to be. Sure ain't. That's weird. Are there supposed to be graffiti here and way over there? Or did someone just 
forget too often. Or is it some weird kind of graphical bug? Wouldn't know. I'm curious which version of Batman this is. Watch wallet cash. But this goes through you. Hmm. Hey, you heard him, man. The hell are you waiting for? You're making a mistake. You already made one. Come in here. The next one kills you. And him. Gentlemen. Fellas. <laughs> Keep walking, all right? This don't concern you, twerp! You see, that's where you're mistaken. My old mate and I have some catching up to do. And you're oh. The moment! Come here! Whoa! I think that'll do! Nice. Old mate's beating people up. But he is kind of... Like you don't belong. Ouch! This seems like it's hurt. And this is my park, mine. You hear that? Run along, children. <laughs> oh, hey, Bruce. You've got a little. Uh... Um. <laughs> yeah. Good as new. Woo! That was the right little scrap, eh? Nothing kicks in the system like a dash of adrenaline, eh? Besides, mm -hmm. someone needed to deal with the rubber situation here. Well, thanks for the backup. I yanked you away from your bloody ivory tower, Bruce. Least I can do is make sure you don't get shaked. <laughs> oh, that's very thoughtful of you. Yeah, it's been Indeed it is. Two decades. And you know yeah. what? I haven't been mugged once that entire time. <laughs> uh... Uh, that wasn't why I brought you here, mate. Right now, I am trying to recognize the little Bruce I used to run around this place with. Back when it wasn't, you know, like this. Yeah. This park used to mean something. I'm a feeling like this can kids, only go one way. Families. People came from all over to visit. Oh, Mum and Dad, they put so much work in here. Glad they never saw it like this. It's a shame what happened. It was beautiful once. And now it's a hellhole. Last yeah. thing our parents ever built. <sighs> I wonder if I can restore it. Right through people. In memory of his parents. Mum committed to Arkham. Dad ended it himself, he did. What the hell happened to your family, to... Oswald? There's nothing left, Bruce. I know, Alfred told me. It's funny, huh? Same place that ground my family to dust. Gave you the good life. Used to run in the same circles we did. Hobnobbing parties, round the world vacations, unlimited potential. Now all I got is this park. My parents are gone too, Oz. I know, Bruce, I know. I'm sorry for it. But I have my own funerals to attend. So let's not compare loss. Bruce. You still care about something more than just yourself. Yeah, that's Although, true. I was surprised to see Carmine Falcone at your party last night. Made himself right at home. That oily... <sighs> Falcone was an uninvited guest. That's it. I never want to see his face again. On that... We can agree in earnest. <laughs> Balcone made a stack of cash and corpses a mile high, ruining families like mine. And like mine, All he probably. Needs push. And. Hey, I agree. Whoa! Be a treat to watch him at pavement. Sorry, His mate. This reunion got a lot more green. Codes teleported. Things <laughs> are going to be on the upswing soon, though. A revolution is knocking on Gotham's door, and I'm here to let it in. 
Oswald is a bit more like the Which Joker in this one. You, Bruce? You see, you oh, throw a rock right. in any direction, you break a window that Wayne Enterprises owns. As the True rich enough. powerful go, oh, you top Gotham's list. Eh, oh, I don't like to brag. Guys. We're gonna smash windows and cross off names all the way down. Like I said, it's not gonna be pretty. It's gonna be beautiful. I'm not your enemy, Oz. That remains to be seen, don't it? Probably I'll end up I've being got great too. affection for you, Bruce. I really do. Which hmm. is why I'm warning you. When this whole thing starts, make sure you're on the right side. Noted. Good seeing you, Bruce, but I got some rocks to collect. <laughs> Cheers. Cheerio. That sure was interesting. Press conference for a new hospital starts soon. Car waiting on the south side of park. All right. I wonder whose bust this is. <laughs>